Hi everyone, welcome to day 14 of my 30 days SQL challenge series where I solve data analyst and business analyst interview question for SQL. So today we'll be solving a question that was asked in LinkedIn data analyst interview. So let's see the question first. Assume you are given a table containing job postings from various companies on LinkedIn platform. Write a query to retrieve the count of companies that have posted duplicate job listings. Definitions Duplicate job listings are defined as two job listings within the same company that shared identical titles and the descriptions. So let's go ahead and see the table. So in the table, we have the job ID, company ID, title, descriptions. So how we will identify if it's a duplicate job posting? If the company is the same and the title and the descriptions, everything basically is same. That means this is a duplicate posting. So for example, if you see like any company where you will see like this one, you can see for this company you can see the company name is same 123 123 and the title is also same data scientist data scientist and the descriptions are also same which means this is a duplicate posting like the second one so let's go ahead and see what are the things that we need to basically solve this question so first we need to find out the count of company right who posted duplicate or you can say who posted more than one you know jobs with same title and descriptions right so this is what we need so we can use a group by functions to you know solve this uh, questions so let me just go ahead and start writing our query so we'll start with the company uh, company id so then we will take that title and then we will basically take that the descriptions descriptions and we will also just for now we'll just count the number of job they have posted okay so i'll just give it a alias one and i'll just give it alias like total job total number of job okay so now if i just use a group by functions by the company id title and description so i can just give a alias like one two three so instead of like basically typing the whole you know that uh, column name you can simply give it a alias so one means the first column the two means the second column and three means the third column so now if you just go ahead and run it so let's go ahead and run it so now you can see we have the company id for each company for each basically you know title and we can see the how many job they have posted for the same title and same descriptions so now this one which is data engineer and this is the descriptions they have only posted one job now if you see the second one which is this one three four five data analyst and for this they have posted two basically this information is actually having two records in the table so this is a basically duplicate posting so same goes with this one as well so now we can go ahead and you know just using a having conditions we can just filter out the data only for the duplicate records so having we can say count of one which is this one greater than one so if you just do it now you should be having like the you know number of company that have posted more than you know one jobs the same title and the same description so now you can see there are two company who have posted basically duplicate jobs so now we need count of this right so we need to use a subquery to basically solve it so we can just go ahead and use a subquery to basically count this two row now i know that we only have two rows in this result in the main database you might have like you know thousand of companies who have posted duplicates so we need to write a query instead of basically just you know counting it from here manually so we can just use a simple you know queries to basically solve it so i'll just select one one means the number of rows from this table basically any column i'm just selecting and name it as like count of count of company count of company okay and i'll be just using from from basically and I'm going to put this query inside the the you know a sub query so that is how basically we will be solving this x1 I'm just giving an alias so whenever you are using any sub query in the form then you just have to give an alias so let me just reorder it let me just reorder it give me a second yes so now we can just go ahead and run it it should actually give us the count of total company who have posted more than you know like i mean who have posted duplicate jobs in linkedin platform so there's a mistake i'm sorry i cannot basically close the query here because we are using you know a sub query 
so we can just put the closing statement here so now you can see that the count of the company who have posted duplicate jobs is two so this is what it was asked in the question so that is it for this video thank you so much for watching the video till the end i'm going to share a link in the description of the video for you to basically download and practice the same if you want and uh, do subscribe to my channel if you really like the content have a good day take care bye bye